Picture yourself back in the golden age of Hollywood, where the silver screen was graced by legendary stars whose talent shone as bright as the studio lights. Among these luminaries, there was one actress whose presence was as unforgettable as her performances, Jean Arthur. As you journey through the annals of your cinematic memories, there's a good chance you've encountered this iconic actress at some point in your life. Whether it was the sparkle in her eyes or the undeniable charisma she brought to every role, Jean Arthur left an indelible mark on the hearts of moviegoers worldwide. Now, let's dive a bit deeper into the fascinating world of Jean Arthur, exploring some lesser-known facts that might just rekindle your admiration for this timeless star. After all, her career spans several decades, filled with remarkable achievements, and her life story is as captivating as any script Hollywood ever produced. So, sit back, relax, and let's uncover the hidden gems of Jean Arthur's life and career. Jean Arthur's unveiled birth year, 190 Jean Arthur, the beloved American actress known for her iconic roles in classic Hollywood films, had a fascinating mystery surrounding her birth year. For many years, during her lifetime, her date of birth listed in the World Almanac was given as 1905. It was later updated to 1908. Not until after her death did further research confirm that the correct year was 190. Jean Arthur's career spanned several decades, from the 1920s to the 1950s, during which she appeared in over 90 films. Her talent and distinctive voice made her a fan favorite, but her true birth year remained shrouded in uncertainty. While she never publicly disclosed her real birth year during her lifetime, it added an air of mystique to her persona. It wasn't until after Jean Arthur passed away in 1991 that diligent researchers uncovered official documents, including her birth certificate, that conclusively established her birth year as 190. This revelation surprised many who had long believed she was born in 1905 or 1908. Jean Arthur's career highlights include starring roles in classic films such as Mr. Smith Goes to Washington and The Talk of the Town. She was known for her unique blend of wit, charm, and vulnerability, which endeared her to audiences and critics alike. In addition to her acting career, Jean Arthur made a noteworthy transition after retiring from films. In the late 1960s to 1973, she taught drama at prestigious institutions like Vassar and the North Carolina School of the Arts, passing on her knowledge and passion for the craft to the next generation of actors. While Jean Arthur's birth year mystery may have added a layer of intrigue to her life story, it's her timeless performances on screen and her dedication to nurturing young talent that continue to define her legacy in the world of entertainment. In conclusion, Jean Arthur, the legendary actress, left behind a captivating tale regarding her birth year, with the truth finally emerging as 190. Her career and contributions to film and education continue to be celebrated and cherished by fans and students alike. Jean Arthur, a renowned American actress, left a lasting mark on the world of entertainment. While there's limited information available on her teaching drama at Vassar from 1968 to 1973, one intriguing aspect of her life is the alleged origin of her stage name. It is said that she combined the names of two of her greatest heroes, Joan of Arc and King Arthur. This unique choice reflects her personality and her connection to the characters she portrayed on screen. As for her final resting place, Jean Arthur's ashes were scattered off Point Lobos, California, USA. This coastal location adds a poetic touch to her farewell, connecting her even more deeply with the natural beauty of the region. Jean Arthur's legacy endures through her memorable performances in classic films and the interesting stories surrounding her life. Her stage name alone is a testament to her creativity and the impact she made in the world of cinema. Jean Arthur, a remarkable actress in her on-screen chemistry, Jean Arthur, the renowned actress of the golden age of Hollywood, left an indelible mark on the world of cinema with her exceptional talent and distinctive style. While there may not be substantial information to confirm that Jean and James Stewart had a close off-screen bond, it's intriguing to note that Stewart held her in the highest regard, famously stating, the finest actress I ever worked with. No one had her humor, her timing. Their on-screen chemistry was palpable, a fact attested to by their multiple collaborations, including iconic films like Mr. Smith Goes to Washington, and You Can't Take It With You. 
Audiences were enthralled by their performances, which seemed to effortlessly capture the essence of their characters' relationships. However, it is also worth mentioning that Jean Arthur reportedly turned down the role played by Donna Reed in the beloved classic It's a Wonderful Life, because she did not want to work with James Stewart again. While this decision may have disappointed some fans, it sheds light on the complex dynamics that can exist between actors in the film industry, where personal preferences and professional considerations sometimes clash. Another intriguing aspect of Jean Arthur's life is the alleged inspiration behind her stage name. She is said to have combined two of her greatest heroes to create the persona we know today, Joan of Arc and King Arthur. This unique choice reflects her strong and independent spirit, characteristics that she often brought to her roles on the big screen. In summary, Jean Arthur's legacy in Hollywood is marked by her exceptional talent, on-screen chemistry with James Stewart, and the fascinating origin of her stage name. While her personal life may have remained somewhat private, her contributions to the world of cinema continue to be celebrated and cherished by movie enthusiasts worldwide. Jean Arthur, a beloved American actress, is known for her remarkable career in Hollywood. While there isn't substantial information available about ashes scattered off Point Lobos, California, USA, we do have an intriguing detail about her birth date. For many years, Jean Arthur's birth year was listed as 1905 in the World Almanac. Later, it was updated to 1908 during her lifetime. However, it wasn't until after her death that further research confirmed the correct year to be 190. This discrepancy adds an interesting twist to her life story. Additionally, in 1972, Jean Arthur attended an event at the Yale Law School Film Society weekend with Frank Capra. Capra invited her to stay for a screening that night, assuring her of an enthusiastic audience. However, she declined, citing the need to go home and feed her cats. This anecdote offers a glimpse into her personal life and priorities. Jean Arthur's career and personal choices continue to fascinate and endear her to fans, making her a memorable figure in Hollywood history. Jean Arthur, a celebrated actress of the golden age of Hollywood, received high praise from renowned directors for her exceptional talent. George Stevens referred to her as one of the greatest comedians the screen has ever seen, while Frank Capra deemed her his favorite actress. Billy Wilder, too, was captivated by her performance in A Foreign Affair, describing it as simply wonderful. Interestingly, Jean Arthur once made a noteworthy decision in her career. She turned down the role of Donna Reed in the iconic film It's a Wonderful Life. Her reason, she didn't want to work with James Stewart again, showcasing the complexity of Hollywood relationships. On another occasion, when her contract with Columbia Pictures ended in 1944, Jean Arthur couldn't contain her excitement. Reportedly, she ran through the studio streets, exclaiming, I'm free, I'm free. This moment captured the relief and liberation she felt after her contractual obligations came to an end. In the world of classic cinema, Jean Arthur remains a cherished figure, admired by both colleagues and audiences for her outstanding talent and memorable choices. As we bid adieu to this journey through the cinematic world of Jean Arthur, I invite you to pause for a moment and delve into the tapestry of your own connection with this remarkable actress. In the world of film, Jean Arthur's performances were not mere portrayals, but invitations to explore the depths of human emotion and the complexities of the human spirit. From the effervescent Saunders in Mr. Smith Goes to Washington to the endearing Alice Sycamore in You Can't Take It With You, Arthur's talent was a kaleidoscope of characters that mirrored the various facets of our own lives. Her ability to capture the essence of her roles left an indelible mark on the hearts of audiences, transcending generations. Now, I encourage you to share your cherished memories, your favorite lines, or the moments that moved you the most while watching Jean Arthur on the silver screen. Whether it's a heartfelt connection with her wit, her charm, or the depth of her characters, your thoughts and recollections are a testament to the enduring impact of her artistry. Jean Arthur's contribution to the world of entertainment is nothing short of legendary, and her legacy continues to resonate with cinephiles worldwide. As we celebrate her timeless performances, we express our deepest appreciation for the joy and inspiration she has brought to our lives. Thank you for taking this journey with us and for sharing your personal connection with Jean Arthur. Your participation enriches the tapestry of her legacy, keeping her spirit alive in the hearts of all who appreciate the magic of the silver screen. 
Until our paths cross again, keep the love for cinema alive.